Hello YouTubers, my name is Nixvi and you are on the channel for those who love inline skating and wants to progress in it. And today I'm starting a series of new videos that I decided to call Winning from the very beginning. Yeah, poetry is my second passion after inline skating. In this series of videos I will be showing you the main steps of inline skating, starting from basic stance and ending with small jumps and stopping techniques. At least that is how I plan. I don't know what my lazy side will say about it. And today we will start from the basic stance for inline skating. And if you are only a beginner and not very sure in standing on skates, it's better to find some surface that is not skatable. For example, the ground. I'm pretty sure that you know that while you are inline skate, you have to bend your knees. And really bending of the knees is one of the main points of basic stance. But you should know how to bend your knees properly. There is a few variations. You can bend your knees like that, like you're sitting on the chair. And this is not the proper stance for inline skating. How you really should bend your knees is like that. The bending is here and also here. So, in fact, the main part is here when you're arch meets your ankle. It should be some sharp angle there. And to check your proper bending of the knees, you can look down and see if your knee pad, if you are wearing the knee pads that I really recommend you, your knee pad is closing from your view the toe of your skate. So if we will put the line here, it will go somewhere in the beginning of the front wheel. This is the proper position of your knees and your legs. You should feel how the front part of your ankle pushes the tongue of your skate. If you have that feeling, then you are standing right. If you don't have it like this, then probably your position is not very good. When you will try that position first, you will understand that, in fact, you can put your torso in any decent position. You can go like this and like that, and you still feel pretty comfortable on skates. In fact, you can even make it like that. Now let's talk about the position of your hands. I recommend you to keep it like that, like you are playing volleyball and waiting for the pass, or like you are shouting something to your social distancing neighbor. Turn off your music! Something like that. Now you understand that it's very difficult to fall back in that position, but you can easily fall forward like that. And your hands are protecting your face. Your pretty nose and your Hollywood smile. Of course, you will not be skating in that position all of your time. Usually, skaters are using something like scissor position, like that, and we will talk about that in the future videos. But if you are using such a position of your leg, it is really very helpful in almost all the elements of inline skating. And that's all about the basic stance for inline skating. Thank you for watching. In the next video we will be talking about the first strides on inline skates and the exercises that will help you to avoid that dark or nice position that usually beginners have. Don't forget to like that video and click the subscribe button if you are not yet subscribed. See you in the next video.